Hey guys, it's Mr. Zarzik, and in this video I'm going to show you how to quickly take data for the Bleacher Bums Labs version 2020. Alright, um, so in terms of measuring uh, your drop height, okay, the measure app on iPad has difficulty latching on to, to vertical distances. Alright, and so what I'm going to do instead is, is I just found this extension cord in one of the cabinets. So I'm going to use that to, to measure, or at least to, to get a measurement that I'll then use the measure app, okay, to determine the length. Okay, and so what I'm going to do... Higher is better, so if you're doing this at home, okay, at least to the height of your ceiling. I'm going to use this little metal crossbar here just because it's a fixed point that I've got suspended in the ceiling anyways. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my, my extension cord, all right, I'm going to drop it down to where it just touches, touches the ground, okay? And so I've got that location. All right, I'm just going to fold the extension cord over at that spot. All right, and then since the measure app does a good job of measuring lengths across, along the ground, I'm just gonna take my extension cord, lay it across the ground as straight as I can. So let me just show you real quick what I'm doing here. Okay, and so then I would take the measure app and use it to measure that length on the ground, which is then my height to drop from okay so for the dropping okay so I'm just going to use this volleyball all right I'm going to use the timer on my phone all right so just my little app you can use the one on your phone or your iPad it doesn't make any difference all right and so when I do the dropping watch what I do and take you through it okay so I measured up excuse me up to the the height of this crossbar here, all right? And so what I'm gonna do is, is in one hand, I'm gonna have my timer, in the other hand, I'm gonna have the ball, all right? And I'm just gonna kinda of count down in my head, three, two, one. And then when I let go with the ball, that's when I'm gonna start the timer. When I release the ball, I'm gonna drop it from, from overhead on the side. I'm gonna to try to let it go really fast, okay? Rather than try to track the ball to the ground, okay, what I'm instead gonna do is just kinda of hold my hand with my timer steady, and I'm just gonna listen for the sound of impact. That's gonna give me better data. Okay, so here we go in my brain. Three, two, one. All right. So just so you can see, I got 0.68 seconds when I did a trial practice before I started uh, filming this video. I got 0.70, so very close. All right, if I'm doing this inside a typical room with a 12-foot ceiling, Okay, you gotta measure, but that's approximate, all right? You, you'll get times that are less than a second until you get about two stories off the ground. Okay, that's when you start getting into uh, times greater than a second. So you wanna be in that range of, like I said, half to a point or to one second. Okay, that's pretty reasonable, all right? And you just saw me do it and you saw the time I got. So that's the way you do the data collection for the Bleacher Bum Lab.